Hello Leos, this is your mid month reading that's going to carry us through until July. <clears throat> this reading is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. And let's just get right into this and see what's going on around you guys currently. Ooh, you have that death energy there. Um, but death, yeah, it's a bad ending, but with death and the ending of things come new things right so i feel like something is definitely being transformed here but there's also an ending that has happened okay something that you felt like needed to end and needed to change okay that scorpio energy <clears throat> what's challenging my leos what's challenging leos the Six of Wands here, being able to move forward and open yourself up to new experiences and new people, okay? Um, the Six of Wands, it is a six, so it's about unity, it's about harmony, being um, uh, in sync with yourself, not only with other people, but yourself, because if you're in sync with yourself, then that, you know, people see that, okay? So, I see a change in you, actually, that's going on. Let's see, <clears throat> what is the foundation for Leo's reading? An Ace of Wands. I like it. Okay. There's something new that I feel like you guys are interested in doing. Um, some of you have just started dating someone or you're wanting to start dating someone. You're wanting to get back out there. I feel like there's a situation that ended here for you, okay? And you're ready to put yourself back out there. Hmm. Recent past for Leos. The recent past, what was going on for Leos? Page of Pentacles here. I feel like you guys have been working really hard. Um, the Page of Pentacles is always interested in doing new things, learning new things. Okay. And this can also be somebody that is like a workaholic. You've been working way too much and not allowing time for yourself to enjoy yourself even. And I feel like now you're probably getting to a point where um, you're feeling like you've been doing way too much work without having any kind of play. And I feel like you guys are ready to have some play. Okay. Let's see. Crowning thoughts for Leos. Okay. Knight of Wands. <laughs> ready to have some play. You guys are ready to travel. You're ready to move. I feel like there's been some stagnant energy with you guys. Um, feeling kind of bored. Feeling uh, like you've been um, feeling stifled. You know, almost like you can't breathe. Needing to really release, get out, have some fun, travel. Um, you know, just put some things into action. Here, you got a lot of fire energy around you. And you are fire, so. <clears throat> but we have Sagittarius energy here. What is coming in for Leo's? What's coming in for Leo's? The Hanging Man. Piscean energy. There's somebody here. There's somebody here that I feel you want the attention from but this person's not giving you that attention um if this person was somebody that like really would try with you before they're not trying so much now there's definitely somebody here or either this is you guys wanting to try with someone and really kind of reaching out and wanting that attention from someone you know kind of doing things to like um get their attention and then once you feel like okay this person's not even noticing me this person's not reciprocating what i am 
um, giving them, then you just kind of like stop. You stop all your efforts. So either one of those situations. Let's see how you're viewing your current situation. How is Leo viewing your current situation? So you are viewing your current situation. Okay, I want that one. Ace of Swords. You have two aces here. This is all about new ways of thinking, um, new things that you want to pursue. So there's definitely something I feel like you guys are stopping and something that you're starting. Okay, whatever that means for you, you're stopping something because you feel like that is not serving you and you are beginning to do something else. You have an idea to do something else, something different. I definitely see you guys changing. Or if you're the type of person that, you know, you like for people to come to you, I feel like that's what you're changing. You are actually going and getting your person, somebody that has decided to not do anything else you know your way and so you're deciding to reach out you know extend an olive branch here okay so definitely something that you're stopping and something that you're starting like you, you've changed um, changed up something here what is the influence here for Leo's Knight of Cups mm, there's a love here there's a love here I feel like you want to get you want to explore. You want to let somebody know just how you feel about them. And I feel like you're going to get it. Okay. Hopes or fears for Leo. Oh, the tower. Huh. Some of you are afraid it's too late for you. You're afraid that this cannot be mended. You're afraid there's too much instability. There is a past person here, I feel, somebody that you broke up with, um, somebody that you moved away from. I feel like some of you are like going back to a certain location where you moved out of or you're going back to a situation where you guys broke up. And I feel like you are extending yourselves here, the Scorpio energy, but you're afraid that it's maybe too late or is still uh, too broken or something like that. But I see, look at this, the Magician and the World energy here, um, Gemini, Virgo, uh, Scorpio, Leo, Aquarius, Taurus energy is here, but I see you trying to... Um, make some shit happen here you're hoping that you guys can start over you're hoping that you can manifest the hell out of this shit and you can okay you definitely can hmm. let's see <coughs> excuse me I'm all outcome here for Leo's. What is the overall outcome for Leo's? Three of Swords there. I see some disappointment for you guys um, towards the end of this month going into July. Uh, there may be a breakup. There may be a situation where um, you guys remain broken, broken up, but you know, this is just for a span of a couple of weeks, right? So, um, things may not work themselves out so easily and de depending on your situation you may have to give it a little more effort you may have to give it a little more time right so this is Libra energy um, I don't know if there's a three-party relationship here I cannot say that uh, some of you may find out that uh, the person has moved on with someone else Especially if you've been like broken up for a while, you kind of almost um, 
you know, open yourself up to the possibility that maybe this person has moved on if you haven't been with them in a while. But still, all in all, I mean, it's, it's no less heartbreaking to find that out, especially when you are wanting to fix something, wanting to start over, have that in your head. Okay. Now, another scenario I'm getting here is that um, some of you are actually uh, breaking up with someone. You're going to break up with someone. And you feel like it should have been over. Um, you guys are wanting to explore new things. And, um, yeah. Okay. So that is what I have for you guys. And I'll be speaking with you guys soon.